have a lot of journals so many that they've kind of become my friends and um, I've gotten so used to journaling that I don't know how to open up to people. My simplest reason to have started journaling um, was to bring order into my very chaotic life. I wasn't really dealt many great cards, which I'm very grateful for because I feel that in this lifetime, it's best to be able to experience something or to be something to learn, right? So to figure out who Tiona White was with a leveled head, I journaled and I journaled my ass off. As a teenager, I went through a lot of phases when it was hard to grasp the idea of life and why people were mean and why things didn't work out the way I wanted them to. But journaling brought me back to a center point and it absorbed all of my anxiety, my depression, my stress. I'm waiting for the plane. But yeah, it slowed my thinking down almost in a meditative way to where I was able to analyze my problems and then respond appropriately. And ultimately, it, it made me realize that a lot of my problems really didn't exist. Things just started to sound really dumb once I wrote it on paper. So journaling in a way made me realize not to really sh stress about the small things and just go with the flow of life. So I created a very comfortable relationship with a pen and paper, and because it was the one thing I could do without any judgment, it was the only thing I did. In my head, I was thinking like, why would I open someone up to my problems when I could just write it down? I don't wanna introduce my problems into other people's lives. Like, that's just gonna add stress on them. It's, it's none of their business, really. It's nothing is their uh, responsibility, it's all mine. And that is exactly why today it is hard for me to open up to people. My brain is also wired in a way where written words come out better than spoken words. So I started to avoid phone calls or going out with people, seeing people in person. And when I speak out loud, sometimes I have trouble finding my words. Even I could know exactly what I'm talking about and it would make complete sense in my head, but it just never comes out the way that it is in my head. Every now and then I would have like a little stutter. Sometimes I mispronounce things and it truly is just because I don't exercise my voice enough to be confident in speaking. And not only that, you know, I became so comfortable with not needing to speak. As long as I had a pen and paper, I was fine. But now the problem is I am yearning for human connection, just being able to connect with others. And it's been a process, a harder process than I thought it would be, but I want to so badly feel how it feels to truly connect with someone with everyone really just to be able to give and receive better i feel that because i've been in a journal so long that i'm actually it's actually pretty easy for me to absorb you know i'm so much more of a better listener than i am a person that speaks out so i am able to absorb everything but um and receive everything but i'm just now figuring out how to give it back the solution i would say is this video is me being vulnerable in front of a camera and actually speaking i want to give a better example of who i am to learn to express myself in ways that were harder you know like a little bit more challenging not only does it help with my you know verbal communication but i also feel that it's going to help with the communication with myself and my body this YouTube video it was really me testing my waters a little bit more, just being more vocal and to open my throat chakra up a little bit and just speak out. Even if I don't know what to say, I just want to say something so that it gets me into a space um, where I can like continue to learn and to continue to um, 
get more familiar with my own voice. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> a lot of things are trial and error, you know, like, and most of the time you just gotta do something. Even if you don't know what you're doing, you just gotta do it and trust the process. And that's exactly what I'm gonna be doing. So, this is the first video that I will be speaking or showing. This is the first video that um, I'm gonna make this kind of a series where instead of writing in my journal, I'm going to vocalize my journal. I'm going to um, use my voice as my journal now. I like that, that's a great idea. Well, this is journal number one.